welcome back to the world today. Today I'm doing some more book specialist things. Also, it's raining very heavily, but that's perfect. I love the rain. First book. This is this baby is from like uh, two years ago. Well, it was like one year ago. I don't recall. But one thing that I know is that this was a really good drawing book. Now let's take a peek. Yes, here we go. We got the Silver Surfer. He's blowing us some bubblegum. I don't like Among Us. We got Charlie. This guy is writing some notes. Oh, damn, he had the hot Skittles. Footman. Big cola, dude. And then we got... What the hell is this? Birthday boy, it's Joyce. He's going to kill him. Perfect. Yes, I am on the line for complaints towards Seven, mate. See, you put on a race to show live. And now, an Aussie South Park. The racist show was like Chips Rafferty, I think. Oh, no, that was either nine or something. I don't know, I've got a bit confused. We've got this guy, Ween. Then we got Jerma and an idiot, and they're going up against the giant enemy spider. Getting over it with some idiot. We got Spooker 2. Catch. Cooked toast. He's a favorite. We have It's What You Deserve. We've got the incinerator. This guy's smelling the markers. No more Halloween. Good. We got the Balloon King and Ghost. He's invaded my boot. Oh, damn it. This page fell out. Uh, don't worry, I'll just keep it in there. Right. We've got the Living Breads. We have the Mother Load. They're finding the Mother Load. We've got Troy from Struggling. And we just got this page. I'm just going to let you have a look at it. <laughs> the Living Breads. That's perfect. Now, next one. Here we go. Not the boy's choice of the movie. Yeah, I get it. All right, this one. We got some more here. Ghostbusters, I'd come into town. That guy was kind of, uh, Joel was kind of funny when he wrote that album. I, I'm hungry. I am not. We got this dude. He's abducting this fella. Maybe not abducting, maybe he's just taking him on a ride through across space. Trust no one. I mean, you you shouldn't trust anyone, man. Ooh. Look at that shovel. It's a horrible looking shovel. Oh, that's my NBN. Like I used to have this NBN round and I went when I went to bed. Long hair. We got the bubblegum hair. Alright, next one. We got these dudes. It's the birthday boy's choice! Yeah. Look at this frog. Bow before me. We have the king. He's awesome. Beware the purple purple. I have free candy in my van. As I was talking about purple guy from Five Nights at Freddy's with Josh, and then they came up with the purple purple. <laughs> now remember, if you do drugs, you go to hell before you die. Oh, by the way. Candy? It's like a swear word in Australia because uh, we say lolly. Look at this dude. We got these. Oh, can you go that? I like you. I hate you. We got this dude. With a little baby. Oh, feeling that little baby. Guy taking off his head. Help! Oh, my tumor has cancer. Aussie sweetness, good to eat in a surround the juicy Oh, I remember that song! Aussie sweetness! Okay, here we go. We got this one. Left that boy again. We got all these, man. That's perfect. Ooh. Right. Next one. Oh, we got Stripper Cowboy. This guy was awesome. He's like the best character ever, man. We got uh, all these fellas watching the Stripper Cowboy. And then we got Troy with the music. Oh! That's how he sounds. Oh, look at this picture. This is a great one. We got, go to the pool. I weigh 30 kilograms and got abs. Well, now I weigh 37 kilograms. 9-11, shine above. Sir, there's a man on the wing. <laughs> I have my lemons. Yay. Oh, look at this, dude. Sniper melon. Uh, yeah. That's my depiction of EA. 
because I was talking to it with the boys. Have you seen my mammals? Right. Oh, kill, 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 kill. They're fighting. Future Boy travels on a space boat through dimensions, galaxies, and universes. I sounded like David Berth just then. Unfinished Spy vs. Spy comics. All right. Future Boy had reached a green dimension after going through the dimension portal. The blue boy shall not be sacrificed. We've got these this place called the Green Dimension. I like it a lot. Look at that little flower. <laughs> look at all their heads. They all look so strange. But I like them. Oh look. We all bleed green. That's my that's what happens to we all bleed, bleed blue. Right. Wash my bacon very closely. My bacon. We got miscellaneous man. Help. My bones. God, the law sucks. Oh, that's a loser right there. We got birthday boy again. Got the cute oh, mom. Indeed. Lovely gift. And we got uh, this fellow's over here. I got pink. Oh, comic. Oh, hi. What flavor? Give me a flavor. We had to kill him. All right. But Future Boy had returned. Oh wait, this is the one with the flesh zombie jaw helmet, isn't it? Yes, yes, yes. Flesh zombie jaw helmet, $29.95. I came up with his voice, he'd go, Hello there! Yeah. Well, he's in your head. Okay, miscellaneous education class. We need to find a way to stop most cringe being uploaded daily to YouTube. Start a rant. Or explode America! Okay. And go closer to the tree. Do this as a great friend to me. Nice tree. <gasps> oh, dude, I love spooky movie at 4 a.m. Oh, no. Oh, no. We got a strange looking wizard. We must contain the firstborn. What's that in the distance? The Master Weevil. Oh, this is the character page. We got Aiden in the car. The kid called Aiden. No, the kid called Aiden asked me to draw him a cool car. I did so and else his name. He's sucking up the gumballs! That's Gumball Weevil. With new legs. I love the Gumball Weevil. He's like a great character. We got Brandon. Simple body. We got the ghosts. The car things. Is it really kind of We got the car things. We got the future boy. We got the cowboys. And Tiny Bill. Flesh zombies and Troy. We have William the Buffet Boy. Living Breads. And Cook's Toast. Cook's Toast is a nice little fellow, isn't it? We just got these. Tadpoles of the future of the universe. Ah, poor little birthday boy. Future boy will turn in one page. Wait a moment. Oh, vending fly. I should make that a new guy. Okay, go. Future boy had realized the tadpoles of the future of the universe is better future telling talent than him. Oh, I got T bone cooking. It's Scott Peeple. Here he is. Ah, uh, this is when my video game concept started. These are like, uh, concepts for a video game called Bring Me a Sandwich would be similar to a video game called Gesundheit. All right, let's take a peek through it, man. Look at that. Yeah. You know what? It's kind of starting to drag on a little bit, but, you know, I'll tell you this much, right? So far, from what I've seen, right, I'll... I'll also, I know what all the video game concepts are. I might save that for a different video, but so far, I wrote that book. This is a definite 9 out of 10 because it reminds me of Gundy, which is the greatest place I've ever been in my entire life. And, man, this is the ideal drawing pad. That's why I rated it the 9 out of 10. Time for the next book. Book two. Right, this one I think is uh, much older than most of the other ones. So we're gonna have a peek. Uh, let's see. We got a pie. And there's some cinnamon. Hmm. Maybe we could put the cinnamon in the pie somehow. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what this one's really about. Okay, we got a random picture of a guy that shoot a zombie. Alright, we have Paris Magazine. 
magazine. Oh, wait, that's the one from uh, the B-movie where he tries to whack him with the magazine and he calls it the Paris one. We got the um, sweetener. That's a lot of pages. We got another random picture. We got Tiger Cat Zombie B. I'm loving it. It's like a rose. Alright, next one. We have a weird looking dog man. We got a dude, a hospital, and we got flaming head brother. Yeah, we're gonna call him flaming head brother. We got wait, is that like I don't know what this is about. Oh now I see it! Uh, I put. No. This is like Goku and some random other idiot. I don't, I don't know what this is, but. I don't know. We got halves, chocolate, and stuff. I think this is for like. Oh, I don't know, man. This is for like school. Okay. Go. Take out the cheese. Burger, please. <laughs> I think my mother drew this, this character here. And we, he needs cheese. Mike, we are walking on water. He's just like Jesus. Next one. Farting bum. <laughs> From Kobe Lamb, Lenny Place. This dude shooting a zombie. Zombie swallows the bullets. He explodes the bullets. Okay, we got this dude. Nine cat and that guy. Wait a moment, those are the dudes that make comics. Oh, we got this one. Changing that to two pages. Hi, I'm Lenny McLean, and today we are going to be looking at some Undertale fans. I want the memes, but I was told to look at Undertale fandom. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. Hi, ho. Hey, bro, you want spicy memes? Ah! God bless. Just realized I was a Undertale. Yeah, you should have burst it in the song, William. Here we go. Well, Alright, we're gonna read this anyway! Alright, here we go. Here we have the fan fiction. Uh, ah, uh, jeez, I hate these people. Me too. <laughs> Cover your eyes, kids, the ship. I got some of this on the Undertale anime app, because there are too many shippers there. But I care about my PC more than my phone. The PC has more memes. Right, I, I like Lenny McLean as a character, but not as what the stunt he pulled there. Lenny McLean being the Chad he is, Speaking honestly, he would not do that. <laughs> right. We got all this stuff. People playing kazoos and stuff. <laughs> Guy driving the truck. <laughs> Big truck. We got this. Dally H. I love him. We got the Dim Peeper and Punch Man Studios. Oh, yo, boy. I think this is where I get a teensy bit. Wait a moment. I just realized something on the page. No! You did not see it! Right, we got uh, Finger Larry. And we got the idiotic sand guardian. Maybe. Yeah, I should make another one. We got blood. I like that dude. What would the what did the LUD stand for? Comment down below. We got Dorcas and Squiggly. They are bad. They are very nice friends. We got the person known as me. The person known as you. <laughs> we got Ear Eerie. We got Larry. Look at that dude. We got Lome. Where's the next page? Oh, it's an older one! Boy, I think this guy's dead. Right, a person known as Dave. Hmm. We got this guy reading a book. We got this guy 
pistol. Mm -hmm. He doesn't look too happy. We've got more of these. We got uh, Jimmy Flago. We got that Zoggy. Oh wait, this is drawn by Louie. No, I don't care about that loser anymore. Right, here we go. Uh, I finally found it. The Scroll of Truth. Should go back and charge. Ha! Small child. Small. What's the cookies? I can't reach it though because it's crazy on. me, younger, well, I didn't know that this was not cool. I mean, I guess, speaking honestly, it kind of does work well, man. kind of is cute. But I overdone it. I mean, everyone overdoes it at some point, don't they? We all do it. It's just the circle of life, man. Right. I think this is drawn by a friend, Jack. That's out of portal. Oh, uh, you're fired. Jack. Throws away the Jack thing. What? I don't really know. Q, ear kill, scream. We've got weird color. He's about to shoot him with a gun. Right, here we go. Oh, this is good! This is a rage comic! Uh... Le only miss child walking to school. Le other child walking to school. Oh, hello, who are you? A kid with Fuji. Oh, yeah. Well, good. Shave your stash. Also, we have, we all have food to eat. <laughs> <laughs> this kid is late for school. Oh, this is another one, uh, Jack's one. Jack's one. School. <laughs> You need a whole pass. Press to enter. Red, red left. Red left the game. Fortnite school server. <laughs> we have put this. Looking at that thing. I am looking around the shop. I do not supply efficient money and currency to possess it. You can try your luck in stonks. Oh. And he has been stonkered. I mean, I didn't get that from Reddit. I really got it from like, uh, there was like these animations on YouTube. Made by Tim Attainment, I think. We got retired John Cena. He actually didn't retire like that. He actually became Chinese. He went to China and he learned uh, all his Chinese language. That's how uh, he, he got the Bing Chilin quote, you know? And we got Fabulous Furbula. Furbia. I can't imagine what the last page will be. Cause I usually make my pages like a combination of everything. Well, we have to the end. Oh, this doesn't look too bad. Oh no, this dude's getting sucked in, man. We got all that. And that is the end of the book. Perfectionio. Well, um, that one had a lot of twists and turns in it. I'm gonna write this one a uh, pretty bloody good. Seven out of ten because it deserves it, man. This book is like half good. Yeah, you know, could have improvement, but I like it. Yay! Oh, man, we laid down for such a long time, man. I don't even know what's going on anymore. What have I got to do to find a book, man? What have I got to do? Hey, what, what's that over there? Wait a moment. Hey! Oh, oh okay, it's, it's nothing interesting. It's just a reading. Alright, I guess I'll go back to bed then. Nothing, the more, more sleep can happen. What the? That's it! That's it! I present to you, book three. Bonus book. Now this one, I distinctively remember when I made it. It was back in year two, right? I didn't know anything about fandoms. I was a cool kid. And I decided, hey, why don't I write this book? And you know what? I think I t it turned out pretty well. It didn't go over the top at all. Now we're going to read it. And this is reading time episode three. Because I did 
that stupid ass uh, cookie run picture. I did the cook. I did the orange book, and now this is reading time part three. Let's do this. And I might as well read this actually dramatically so I can get good content and stuff. How Sunflower and Peachy Do Got Married by William Whiting. Back in year two, right? Okay. Okay, dude, if there's one thing that I've learned is that don't, don't kill the part of you that is cringe. Kill the part of you that cringes. I've killed some of the part of me that cringes now. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Sun Sunflower was a very happy flower. She liked singing, hugging, of course, and she also invented the sun. Sweetness. Good, good, good grammar, William. One day she was at the park, and she saw his face. He was beautiful. He was stunning. Sunflower slid down over to him and said, Can we have a date? Sure, said Pea Shooter. Healing beam. Pilots had got him warfare back from the day, man. So they had a date at Jalapenos. It was great, Sunflower had the end, at the end of the day. Pea Shooter asked, Will you marry me? Yes, replied Sunflower. And soon they got married. The end. Best book ever, man. Best book ever. Okay, I'm rating that 100 out of 10. <laughs> Into you, my video game concepts. We got Dr. Dawn. Uh, okay. And then after that, we got uh, the Fruitsman. He's got a cherry pity and stuff. And next one, we got Mr. Sir. Read all of this, man. And then we got the last one. We got me. And yeah, there's a bonus up here. If you wear these costumes, I'll explain this on my PlayStation. Now, uh, thank you.